Hi everybody, this is Judy at Judy in the Kitchen. Today we're talking about oils that you would use to protect your wood or bamboo cutting boards versus creams that are out there. There is a difference and a slight difference application on them. Now regarding the oils, you never want to use a regular vegetable oil on your cutting board, even olive oil or canola, peanut, safflower, sunflower, walnut, all of those oils can go rancid in a relatively short amount of time. So you don't want to use them on your board because they'll go rancid on your board and they're going to make it smell bad and you can potentially get some of that rancid oil into food that you're cutting on the board. So you don't want to use those. So you would use either a food grade mineral oil, make sure it's food grade, or you can use regular unrefined coconut oil or you can use fractionated coconut oil on your board. Now the purpose of the oil would be to soak into your board and nourish and refresh those uh, parts of the board, the fibers of the board that are inside there. The oil will soak in to the wood and help to keep it fresh and help to protect it from cracking and drying out. That is something that you can do on a routine basis to help protect your board. Now, there are creams and waxes out there designed for cutting boards. They might be called spoon butter or wood butter or cutting board cream or cutting board wax. These are oils, usually food grade mineral oil, that is mixed with beeswax and maybe another type of wax or two in there. And so they are not as liquidy as you might find with, let's say, the mineral oil that is typically used on a cutting board. These are going to be more of a soft butter consistency or a waxy cream kind of consistency. These are good for coating the outside of your board, helping to fill in knife grooves and small cracks that might be there and helping to provide a finish on the surface of your board that will help to keep the inner fibers from drying out and also helping to keep bacteria from entering the board. So you can use the oil routinely to nourish the wood fibers and help to keep that wood moist with the oil, but then you can finish it with the wax coating or the creams or the spoon or wood butter, whatever you want to call it, to help protect the surface of that. And that will also help to lock in the oil that's on the inside of the wood board. So used consecutively, used together, it should help to keep your wood or your bamboo board from warping or cracking and help to extend the life of it. Let me know if you have any questions or comments below. This is Judy at Judy in the Kitchen. Bye for now.